JWR here, and welcome organics to the last thing I'm going to want to say about this Ghostbusters 2016 movie thing. Now, the movie did come out. Reviews are going out left and right. And I haven't really watched most of them. I just kind of skimmed quickly through to see what the ratings were. And some of them were 50 50, some of them were like, eh. Some of them were hated, some of them were liked. Eh. Now, me personally, I don't watch propaganda pieces most of the time. Most of the time. Most of the time. Hell, if it wasn't shown in high school, I would have seen Schindler's List. That's how much I am against propaganda pieces. When you give someone a movie and they shoot it down and they give the same director the same movie again and they shoot it down again, I would think that would be a cue to not give them the movie. I, apparently I was wrong. That I was getting the movie, whatever. Fine, dandy, whatever. I don't care about the controversy. I don't. I give a fuck. I don't care about propaganda pieces because that's how the marketing was pushing it. It's a propaganda piece. I'm not dealing with it until after rental time. Sorry, that's how I am about all propaganda pieces if I am aware and I can call that's a propaganda piece. Sometimes I can't and I get suckered into it. I'm an organic just like you assholes. So, <laughs> surprise. But here's the thing. If I'm aware that's a propaganda piece, again, like Shinda's List, um, I tend to avoid it. Because, again, as a propaganda piece, it's kind of trying to rally people for it. Like the Passion of the Christ. I avoided that shit like the plague. Not because, you're not a true Christian. No, it's a propaganda piece. Eh, not my cup of tea. Leaving it alone. Not touching it. That said, I truly hope. Because I'm pretty positive. Like I said, I haven't seen the movie. So I'm pretty positive that. This was done in the memory of Harold Ramis. And for those of you who know me, which won't be many of you, but for those of you who know me, you can tell by my tone I am not amused by this. Because, again, you gotta look at this movie, and remember, this is in memory of Harold Ramis. Now, I know what they did. They just tacked it on. I get that. I do. They just tacked it on. Because, clearly, it would not have had this kind of marketing bullshit, controversy bullshit, all this hoot nanny for the controversy, it wouldn't have been a thing if it really was in memory of Harold Rex. It wouldn't have been a thing. But it was. It was a propaganda piece. And then they happened to throw that out there as, oh yeah, this is in memory of Harold Ramis. We made a bust in the movie for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. No. You, you don't do that. You don't do that. You don't do that. You don't fucking do that. In memory of someone, you're supposed to have at least some reverence. Unless you're saying you hate his ass, and you despise his work. I can see that. Or maybe this is your intention, this is your interpretation, and you feel this is, like, the best thing. This is, like, top-notch, the cast meow. This is freaking Moses leading the Jews across the freaking Red Sea by parting it. This is that. I really hope you think that's the case. I really hope you are proud of your work. I really hope... That this is what you want from the memory of Harold Ramis. I really hope this is 100% what you're going... going I, I, yeah, mm, hope so. Again, I'm vastly concerned because this is the same director who was offered this movie a couple of times and he said, No, don't want to do that. No. And then it kept getting thrown at him until he did it. That's... Uh, that hurts my head, because that tells me he's not going to give it 100%. Sorry. I don't care how snazzy of a dresser he is. Allegedly. I haven't seen the guy myself. I don't know. But apparently he's a really snazzy dresser. And I don't care how snazzy of a dresser he is. I don't think he's going to be given Harold Ramis' memory much forethought. Again, it's a propaganda piece. I know this by marketing. Again, if it wasn't a propaganda piece, y'all wouldn't have marketed it that way. Just... Kind of putting that out there. Just fun times. But that's the whole thing I wanted to cover here. I truly hope that everyone involved in this movie truly feels in their heart of hearts 100% that this is what should be for Harold Ramis' memory. This is what you want to settle on and 
encapsulate for Harold Remus' memory. This is it. In, the he in memory of Harold Remus, this movie, Ghostbusters 2016. I hope it's, like I said, I hope it's the best thing since Jesus' birth. I hope it's the best thing since the creation of mankind or humankind, or whatever you want to call it. I hope it's that. I really do. I haven't seen the movie. I really hope it's the best of everything. I hope I hope it has the best special effects. I hope it has the best cameos. I hope it does everything right. I hope. 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 I fucking hope that this is how that it's really a good thing. I really hope that it was a blockbuster smash hit success. Or it's Bargain Man Tuesday. Either A or B. There is no middle ground with this. You're doing something for someone's memory. And if it is only middle ground, then we have problems. So, that's all I'm going to say about this. That's all I'm going to cover. And if you can't tell what my main point is, it is that Ghostbusters 2016... If they made the error of putting a little placard saying, in memory of Harold Ramis, anywhere on there or in the movie, and this is what they went with for, for the final draft, this is it. This is their best acting, their best joke telling, the best story writing, perfect across the board, 100%, flawless, no mistakes, no errors, nothing. This is what they're going to do for someone's memory? Okay. Keep in mind, people remember things like this, especially if it's supposed to be for someone's memory. This is Double R Organics, and uh, I'm out. And like I said, I really hope this is the best thing out there for Harold Ramis' memory. I really do. Otherwise, I have no fucking respect for the dead.